and welcome back to Nicole's DIY. I hope you are all doing well. I'm going to be making this beautiful anchor and it is coastal beach themed. So what I'm going to do is paint this anchor that came from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to paint the whole thing white, acrylic white. And then I'm going to pour some sand that I purchased from the Dollar Tree as well all over the wet paint to create a sand effect. And then once that dries, I'm going to put Mod Podge generously all over the sand so it adheres to it. And then once we're done with that, we're going to add some more sand on top. So it's two layers of sand. So we're going to start by just simply painting. Adding the sand. Just like that. Add a little bit more sand. You can purchase the Mod Podge at Walmart, any craft store, and at the Dollar Tree. So I'm generously going to put it on here over the sand. And what this is going to do is help the sand stick to this anchor. So once we put the seashells and the gemstones on, it adheres to it. And it just doesn't fall off because of the sand. So it's really going to make the sand stay on there really well. Listens really well. That's really nice. And the nice thing that I do like about the sand that you get at the Dollar Tree, it has a little glisten in there. It has a little sparkle, just a little bit. But I will be adding some uh, pretty sparkles to the wet sand. Just so at an angle you can get that real pretty prism, pretty sparkle look that's in the sand that you do see at the beach. Done with that layer, we're going to add the sparkles. Just a little. A little goes a long way. The blue glass beads are from the Dollar Tree. The seashells I got at Walmart. You can purchase seashells at the Dollar Tree. So I already put every all my seashells in place and the glass beads. So I recommend that you do that. You put them in the place that you want them. You leave them there and then you glue underneath. Placing the glue on each shell and then just sticking it on there.
to complete this project, we're going to use this jute and we're going to put it all the way around the outer edges of this anchor. Hot glue all the way around it and press the jute against the hot glue. And then this beautiful coastal beach themed anchor will be complete. And you can hang it wherever you'd like. I'm going to be putting it up on my console table. I thank y'all so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it and liked it. And if you did so, I'd ask that you please give me a good thumbs up. And thank you so much to all my subscribers. Y'all have been really awesome. Thank you so much for all the wonderful comments you leave. And if you're not a subscriber already, and you did like this content, I ask that you would please subscribe to my channel. Last step is to burn off the fibers. There we go, just like that. Don't burn yourself excited to share with you that I've added friend mail to my channel and y'all can write me so I'll leave it in the description below the address and on the screen thank y'all so much and until next time be blessed